Hey, welcome back, family and friends. And I'm finally here to do my Loot Crate unboxing for this month. It's been laying around the house for a while, and I'm so happy I can finally dig into it. I've been feeling better, and I've seen a few of the items in here, and I know I'm going to like them, so I'm bringing my unboxing to you finally. I've been sitting on this crate, and I'm tired of sitting on this crate. I want to open this crate. So Loot Crate for January. The theme was Rewind. So they hit you have some uh, retro, maybe, uh, and some nostalgic items in here that I know I'm going to love. So let's crack it open and get going. I'm going to reach in. I'm going to grab the first item. Some pixelated orange sunglasses. Some more pixelated sunglasses. I have a blue pair. Now I have an orange pair. And I want to chill out with these. And these are branded. Loot Crate exclusives on the side right here. So that's pretty pretty awesome. I'll sit them to the side. Here's an item. Black Tie Geek. www.blacktiegeek.com It's a geeky tie in here. And I know I like it. I don't have a lot of geeky ties. And this one is awesome. It is a tie that you would Space Invaders tie. Let's see if I can give y'all a good look at that. Space Invaders all on the tie. All the way to the very end. Now I don't have a lot of geeky ties, so that's awesome. I have one other geeky tie, which is a Looney Tunes tie. It's got like Bugs Bunny and Taz and everybody on it. It's a pretty cool tie, and I'm going to definitely wear this one sometime. So... Geeky Tie from Black Tie Geek. See if I can get it back in the box real quick and not bore everybody in the process. I'm definitely going to be wearing this tie. I like it. And I like it when they give you something very, very useful like that. Thank you very much, Luke Crate. I've got a Tendo Analog figure. Luke Crate exclusive. Branded again right on the bottom. And this is pretty cool. I like this. Uh, but this, let's see what's inside here. I've seen a few of this from, um, who makes these? Squid Kid Inc. Squid Kids Inc. It's like a little cartridge. Mine says Alien Attacks, which is, you know, a play on um, uh, Mars Attacks. I get my, my mind right. Tim Burton's Mars Attacks comes with the little accessories in the box Let's see if I can throw them together real quick for you these are pretty neat I like these you got little feet you put in the bottom put the little hands on and they come with the little throwback NES zapper gun There you have it. There's my little Tendo guy. His arm is falling off. Let's see if I can get it on better. Get on there. Little Tendo guy. His little beady little eyes down there. These are pretty cool. He'll fit in nicely into the insanity I got going on here. So I got him. Probably put him back in the box or... He just fell off. He just jumped off and committed suicide. He, all his legs and arms popped off. It's horrible. It's horrible. I'll have to pick him up later. Poor guy. Got a comic notebook. It's like a little notepad. Open it up here. This is pretty neat. I like this because I used to doodle a lot and make flip books and stuff. Uh... He just opened the book up, and it's got all the little comic panels in it. The panels, like in a comic book, you can doodle your own comic, and in the back you got your little word bubbles and narration boxes that you can sketch in there and do your little comic. You know, do your little comic on the go. So that is a nice little item. I thought that was very different. I've got the... Loot Crate exclusive 
rewind button there. That is pretty nice. Put that with the hundreds of buttons I have. All right. Here is the t-shirt. Dun 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 It is Voltron. And I've been wanting a Voltron shirt for the longest time. So check that out. It's like a Voltron blueprint shirt with Japanese writing all over it. And then right at the bottom of the shirt, branded Loot Crate right down here. They've branded their shirts now, so that's really nice. I used to love watching Voltron, and this shirt makes me miss my diecast uh, Voltron figure which you put the lions all together and make Voltron. And I used to play with that thing all the time. Why do I let that thing get away from me? I don't know. But I would definitely rock this shirt and wear this shirt because I really, really like it. I was a Voltron fan going up. And if you don't know what Voltron is, go check it out. Because if you're a geek and you don't like Voltron, then you ain't living your life right, people. <laughs> so, okay, that's the shirt. We got your rewind book, pamphlet, booklet. Comes out every month with the box. And this I do like as well because I'm a huge Star Wars guy. Gee, I wonder what gives that away. <laughs> but I'm a huge Star Wars guy. And it's Marvel finally got the license back to do Star Wars comics. Dark Horse did a great job with the comics, but now Marvel has it. And this is a Luke Great exclusive. Marvel Star Wars comic number one. It's got Chewie and Han Solo on the cover. And all the little boxes right here. I don't know if you can see it. All those little boxes on the cover. They say Luke Crate on them. And it's a Luke Crate cover exclusive. So I have to get me another one of these because I don't want to open this one. I do want to read it. But I'm going to try to find a way to get a different number one version so I can read that and keep this one all pristine. Because it's an exclusive. So that'll be great. And I just got a number one of this classic Star Wars comics. So now I have a number one of the classic Marvel series. Now I have a number one of the new Star Wars series. So that is awesome. So, okay. The bots this month. That's all the items. The bots this month. It's like, it's like made like an NES. So that's pretty cool. Let's see if I can do this real quick. I think I know how to make it into the NES real quick. If y'all want to bear with me. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Flip it over. This way and that way. And fadangle it this way and that way. And push and shove and fold. And this is starting to sound like a really different kind of video. <laughs> so I think I about got it, people. All right, I think I finally dangled it around and bent it and moved it and shoved it and poked it and done all that obscene stuff to it. But there you go, NES controller, NES box. That is pretty awesome. It you fold it up, you take the box and you fold it inside out, and you got. I like the NES box. And on the top, you got Rad Dude right here. It's like Ninja Turtles. You got I got Slime, you know, of course, for Ghostbusters. I'm not sure what that little thing is. But over here, you got the Konami Code, which is awesome. That thing got me through many a stage, everybody. And on the back, then we got the plugs. And you got 88 miles per hour right there for the Back to the Future. That is great. And also, in the pamphlet... When you open the pamphlet in the very back of the brochure, pamphlet, magazine, you got a little fold-out NES controller. So I think I might display some character items on top of here. Definitely put my Tendo dude on top and put this around the house. So thank you for watching my Loot Crate unboxing, everybody. I hope you all enjoyed it. Come back and visit your geeky neighbor sometime, everyone. Take care. I got another video coming up. Bye.